All right, so you can see that we are in the middle of a painting. So this painting was done previously. Only few details left. It's a mountain cliff and on the other side you can see the moon. Let's start the details here. So for the trees you can see just uh, we're going to put some uh, leaves and the flowers of the branches. Let's use the uh, smaller brushes to draw the trees and the colorings of the leaves or the flowers. So just you can make like the bush as I'm doing right now. So there's the system. Just develop the bush like this. Okay. And this is going to be all right. Okay, the tree is getting colorful. So for the painting, you know, it's like uh, doing wars in a steady way. Nothing to hurry. Just have your imaginations and going for the right amount of the colors and the shades you want to put to your drawings. Now I'm going to put another one here, like this on top okay so this is the first layer of coloring the tree then i'm going to the second layer which is going to be the white color so after this one i'm again putting another one here it's like the next level tires you can see here mm -hmm. okay and another one in the middle It depends on the uh, amount of the color which one you want to make a dominant into the drawing okay so as you know the space is not that much bigger so the tree is not going to be the much bigger all right because you know sometimes the leaf falls so we're going to put some drops of the falling leaves up to the bottom of the drawing to enhance the extensions of the creativity okay it's like lots of trees are falling not the trees it's like the leaves are falling okay That gives the drawing a right color and a lively attributes. Okay. Mm -hmm. All right. Now I'm moving to uh, put the more borders and the attributes. You can see the white contributions of the three colors. So these are used to separate the segments with the other portions. So that's how you can see that on top it has a different types of uh, areas and the segments the, from the white color. It's getting visually clear. Also, we're going to put few drops here. Mm -hmm especially uh, more white on top okay and these are maybe uh, we're going to uh, merge the both colors like one another mm -hmm. and also a few drops you can see just uh, falling another variations of the shades so this is the purple variations you can see Mm -hmm. on the ground okay and I'm going to make some few white variations okay small details make the drawing looks much better mm -hmm. okay
and uh, if you like you can draw a nice bird flying from the tree over the moon mm -hmm. like this okay few birds are flying and the birds here mm -hmm. and we're going to put some white shade to follow the birds attributes mm -hmm. to make it visually clear so that we can see the appearance of the bars awesome also you can see a few birds flying here mm -hmm. okay so the drawing is getting really nice these are the few details you need to draw while we uh, put the drawing okay all right again putting the colors for the birds so that it looks nice mm -hmm. again getting some colors here okay that's awesome and uh, maybe some trees are falling on the top here mm -hmm. so wind just blows the other parts okay <clears throat> we can use the purple colors to clarify the borders again so it's the other layer I'm putting right now, the final layer, okay, it's just outside of the white layer, mm -hmm. so the drawing is going to be in third level, mm -hmm. okay, all right, putting the borders with another label, Uh -huh. okay so the birds are colorful with the white and purple combinations all right so this makes the drawing a uh, lively and beautiful i hope you like the video please subscribe the channel and put the bell icon sound to get the updates thanks for watching thank you so much have a good day